Hi Annis. Hi Mikey. My name is Martin Santos and I would love to be a part of your team and be your assistant editor. I am 25 years old and I live in Calabasas, California with my five roommates. One of my favorite homes that you've toured is actually the home you did in Calabasas. I'm actually currently filming in the hometown that I grew up in. While growing up here, I don't think I ever saw myself having a career in film. I mainly just stuck to fencing, the sport that I excelled in at the time. Uh, but unfortunately, my knees had had enough by the time I was 16. I had to find a new thing to be passionate about. So while I was in high school, I signed up for a boatload of extracurriculars and the one that I fell in love with the most were my film classes and that's how I really got married to the idea of working in film. So after high school, I ended up going to Academy of Art University where I focused my studies on film editing in particular. Um, while I was there, I learned a lot, not just about editing, but also having to do with videography and cinematography. Um, so I am competent enough with a camera, but I also do look forward to learning more from both, you know, Ennis and Mikey. While in film school, I also got to work on a lot of different types of projects. So I learned even the small things like just being a how to be help helpful on a set. I also learned how to use a variety of different editing softwares from Adobe Premiere to Final Cut Pro, of course, and to Avid Media Composer. Once I graduated film school, I got a pretty decent office job at PG&E while I pursued more film work on the side as freelance gigs. You know, and to be totally honest with you, working those freelance gigs was pretty rough. The pay was really crappy and it started to get to the point where I didn't really know if I was learning anything. Um, so I made it my prerogative to move down to LA um, and see if I could pursue a more serious film career. You know, unfortunately, the pandemic hit. I lost my job. Times got really hard and I got really low. But ultimately what ended up saving me were channels like yours. What I love about you guys' videos is not just the fact that it shows off immaculate homes but it shows off a life that maybe one day I could have. Your videos have inspired me to work harder than ever. So even if I don't get the job, I still wanted to thank you guys for creating quality content that inspires me to both be better and do better. Now, if I had to choose something you could do to improve upon your videos, I would probably say maybe some B-roll of one of you guys walking throughout the space without talking and having it at different angles just to show some of the size and grandeur of the homes that you do visit. I think what I really like about your channel is the rapport between Ennis and Mikey. Um, I feel like it makes the environment seem more open and casual and friendly. I also love the attention to detail that you guys have for every house that you tour. You uh, spare no detail for us, the audience. Even the really small ones, such as you knocking on the dishwasher door just to show that it opens. I also love that you guys take the effort to stay there hours after your video to record the place at night. I think that really livens the place up to see this grand luxury home lit up during the evening and it really sells me on the place. And now for the most difficult part of this video for me to address. Shake Shack versus In-N-Out. I guess to be really specific, I would have to say that overall I think Shake Shack tastes better, but because of the price um, and the simplicity of their menu, I'd have to say that In-N-Out is much more reliable, and I would definitely say that I more often buy from there, so I would have to declare in and out the winners. I really hope that it didn't cost me any standings with you guys. I'm also going to film myself saying that uh, 
Shake Shack is better just in case. I'm gonna do hashtag release the Shake Shack cut. Anyways guys, thanks for taking the time to watch my application to join your wonderful team. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, and I just wanted to tell you guys, you know, keep doing what you're doing. Keep inspiring people like myself and others and keep making wonderful content. Thank you.